good YouTube back here with another video and today we're gonna be talking about pencils and spoons and, uh, and just eyes in general because I know a lot of people are confused on how to actually go about spooning someone or getting an eye as another plan so first thing I'm gonna clear up you can get any dojutsu as any plan and I know that like sounds scary but we'll talk about it for starters to uh, get an eye of any clan to get a dojutsu you want to get a spoon spoon is 40k and it's at a obama npc and i'll show you how to get there from leaf gates so we're gonna go to obama and get a spoon well we're not gonna get a spoon i already have a spoon but i'm gonna show you where to buy one so from leaf i don't know the map's not that confusing there should be a mission queue over here that should sort of help you on how to get there but from wherever you are on the map you just want to head towards final valley if you know how to get there just look for final valley if you can find final valley you know exactly you'll know exactly where to go from there so final valley right final valley's here you come through here and it'll be in this general area you go up here and there will be a house. So you want to go through here. Or you can go this way, it really doesn't matter, but you want to come up this way. So you see where we are, this is where you would normally queue for a mission at. And I'm pretty sure that guy wants smoke. Yep, okay, he does. This guy's getting fucking dogged. Anyways, we're back after that 3v1. Pretty annoying, but so where you want to go is you want to <laughs> you want to come up this way, right? And this is for the uh, spoon. You'll see this little house up here. There's ways to get up there. You can just tree jump up there, and boom. So this is where you would go to get a spoon, pencil, or, or a jar. And you can see a lot of places from here. So. Leaf is over there, Final Valley's down there. You have your scroll mission and uh, capture the point over there. Sand Village this way. And yeah, so it's, it's not a hard place to get to, it's pretty easy. When you get down here, you'll see uh, Spoon is 40K. And when you get your spoon, it'll look like this. Um, There we go. You get your spoon, you hold it out. And it basically looks like this, it's just a huge spoon. Pencil. You use the wooden pencil if you're a three-tama Uchiha and you want to get MS. 
use this on another 310 user and it wipes them outside of PD. So that's what the pencil is for. And I'm pretty sure the wooden pencil is also used for Chinookies as they need to also uh, progress their eyes and whatnot. And uh, yeah, or I, I'm, they might have a different pencil actually, but I'm pretty sure they use a wooden pencil. And yeah, so now we'll talk about uh, debuffs and all that. So if you spoon another eye as a, a different clan, so say I'm an Abraham and I spoon uh, a Hyuga or like a Hyuga eye or let's actually no, no no let's say I spooned a MSI and it gives me an ability that ability will have lessened effects because it's not my eye so if if I have um if I have something like a Madaratsu or maybe maybe I have like Tsukiyomi or something the effects are lessened so the Madaratsu won't do as much damage it'll take much more chakra the eye itself will drain much more chakra yada 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 and uh i'm pretty sure the uh the drawback is much bigger too as far as like getting blindness and whatnot because i have a friend who's used his ms ability like once or twice and he's like i already got a stage of blindness so if you're going to be spooning just kind of look out for that the effects are a little less strong and then yeah another thing i want to clarify if you have an eye, so let's say you've already got, so see how I've got two, two Sharingans, two uh, Mangeku Sharingans, whatever. I can easily just replace it for free, basically. So if I if I wanted another eye, I can just replace it. I just I just click that eye and take it. Boom. It I don't have to actually remove the eye originally or anything. I just I just take another eye. And it replaces the eye I currently have. So, yeah. In case anyone was confused about that, there you go. Also, for medical jars, medical jars are, I'm pretty sure they're broken. That's what I'm being told. They're broken. They're not working. They're not functioning properly. But essentially, what you would do with these is you would get a medical jar. And when you go into PD to spoon somebody, it gives you the option to either directly implant the eye into your into your eye. You like you, you just you get the eye, basically. Or you can put the eye into the jar and you can like save it for like a friend or something, I'm pretty sure. Or you could just, uh, you save it, you store it, and you can put it in your storage and you just have that eye in your storage as a jar. But these are broken, so your only option right now is to just directly implant the eye or just say no, I guess. Alright, so this is like sort of just some advice and how to go about spooning and penciling. And I'm going to say this, and I'm not saying this because I want it to be abused or anything. But I want, if like an admin sees this or maybe an owner watches this video, I want them to consider changing this rule because I think it's pretty stupid. If you are getting attacked by an Uchiha, say, say, so say if right now this guy was like an Uchiha and he decides, oh, he wants to spoon me. I can literally just combat log if I'm not below, if I'm not below 30% or if I'm above 50% and I haven't seen the spoon or whatever. It's, it's pretty stupid. If you are Uchiha and you're not in PD, you're getting attacked by another Uchiha, just log before you get the 30%. It's, it's stupid, but you literally won't get wiped for logging unless you're 30%. I want that rule changed because it's pretty stupid. And and while I may abuse that rule, um, I don't I don't agree with that. I think it's pretty dumb because it's, it's so free. I, and I'm saying this because I've had so many people log to me and whatnot. I'll play some clips. So yeah, hopefully this helps some of you guys with uh, penciling, getting eyes, gives you some info on, on how to go about it and whatnot. And if you have any more questions, just comment down below. Peace.